we are becoming a cashless society, but very, very slowly. And uh, important reasons for that, because cash is actually important for things that it does better than other things do. I mean, what's important, Ken told me not once, twice, three times, he had death threats over this book. I mean, this book was, was, was heated. And Ken told me that we should not do away with small bills, one, five, 20, even up to 50, maybe up okay. to 100. Is that where you are? Is it we got to keep cash within the system? Actually, that's not quite so important uh, because uh, credit cards are becoming better and better and better at smaller and smaller and smaller amounts. So that's not the important part of the thing. In fact, the important part of the thing, I think, is privacy. That is that you can't trace this as well as you can trace other stuff. Yeah. There's just nothing it's the criminal else. activity, right? Not just criminal activity. There's also places where I just don't want to be bothered. I don't want to have to have... Um, uh, a bunch of spam come after me because I bought something, and uh, I, I'd rather not bother with that. I'd rather have this transaction between you and me be final, and we don't have to meet each other afterwards. And that's very hard to do. I feel like just with the more and more <clears throat> digitalization of money, criminal activity, if I were a criminal, I would think, boy, there's a lot of stuff out there for me if I just would do my computer science class. I could really get involved here. Absolutely. And, in fact, one of the things that's caused there to be not as fast to take up by banks of FedNow as you might have hoped is this fear of they don't have the resources yet for handling, checking on fraud in an instantaneous right. fashion. That's really tricky. I have to ask, Bitcoin? Uh. <laughs> Help me here. You're in class. you got a piece of chalk in your hand. Six of the kids are multimillionaires because they bought it where Matt Miller bought yep. it. Quickly, your professor... Bitcoin, is there an underlying that you or the Bank of International Settlement sees? Uh-uh. No, no. I mean, the bit, the, they're the beanie babies of the 21st century. Beanie babies of the 21st century. Boy, that sounds like a Jamie Dimon type. <laughs> Rich, can analysis. you frame that for the commercial we're going to do off of this? Bitcoin is the beanie babies of the 21st century. Uh, yes. How's it going to end? Badly. 